yellow. Ooh, this is a long time coming, isn't it? All right, so. I do not even know how I'm going to start this off. Because this is probably the hardest video I've ever had to make. And it's not one that anyone ever really looks forward to making. It's just the natural progression of things. Yeah, that's all I'm looking at. So you're probably wondering, well, what is up with that? Why am I not on the floor? Wherefore art thou, Morgan? Hmm? Well, sad to say, but uh, my journey with uh, Amazon has kind of come to an end. I'm going to let that sink in for a bit because it's still kind of fresh in my mind and I'm uh, going through all different kinds of emotions right now. And, uh, yeah. Let's, let's start from the uh, beginning. I was hired on to uh, LGB8 in March or October. Yeah, it was one of those months. Maybe it was uh, November. But I was uh, hired on um, to Universal. Uh, sorry, I have to be official here. This isn't easy for me. <laughs> Not in the least. And despite it all, This kind of sucks. This, uh... Fuck. It's like, a whole bunch of emotions are flowing through my head right now because I know what I'm about to say. And I know how to say it but getting the words out from here to here damn I've been with uh, Amazon for near two years And to uh, not hear the not hear the whine of conveyors or the hum of motors, the beeps of scanners, the scattered conversations across the uh, jackpot, manual check, universal receive. Outbound, uh, the PIDs, the outside fingers, the north side, south side dock. Um, outbound, fluid load, pallet receive, toad inject, ISS, learning. To go from seeing everyone on a regular basis to browsing Avenue C and uh, 
then picking pretty much every awesome food item there is. To this. Being alone with my thoughts and trying to uh, process everything. And knowing that I can't see or hear any of my uh, friends and coworkers and uh, yeah, friends, coworkers and home away from home. This the massive it's it's hard. And I know what happened. I know what happened. I know why it happened. I know the people involved. And sucks because I truly truly loved working at LGBA I really did I love clocking in uh, going to uh, Universal Receive or Inbound Dock Love checking in with the uh, PAs and AMs about, hey, what's, what are the numbers today? Um, did we make our goal? How, how are uh, things outside of work? Are you doing good? I love having the sporadic conversations with random people, even if it was just a quick little high bye. I'm going to miss everyone. The thing that hurts the most about this whole thing is the one thing that I was afraid of happening and the reason why it happened is the one thing that uh, is the exact reason why I was let go. <sighs> but I can't I can't focus on the negative. I can't. Because if I focus on the negative, if I focus on the fact that after two years of working my butt off, making sure that everything was taken care of to the best of my ability, and developing my skills not only as a uh, not only as a person, but as an associate of uh, Amazon as a whole if I focus on the negative emotions which is really hard not to do right now and I don't turn that depressing energy into something positive then I can't say that I learned anything at Amazon at all 
and I'm gonna miss everyone. Even the people I didn't didn't really get along with. Even those that for whatever reason. Wanted to, wanted to be gone. So I'm going to turn that, this, uh, this current mood I'm in, which is obviously a mix of things. It's, you know, it's sadness. A little bit of anxiety, a little bit of fear, some regret, some anger. And I'm going to take all that and as hard as, hard as it is for me to say this. I'm going to turn it into something positive. I'm going to... I'm going to turn that frown upside down. Because I do not regret anything. Not, not a single thing. don't regret the skills I've learned I don't and developed I don't regret my personal growth from my starting point at Amazon till today I don't regret any anything I've done or said well there are a couple things that might might have regretted, but those are few and far between. I don't regret the uh, connections I've made. <clears throat> am I deep in my feels right now? Fuck yeah, I am. Who wouldn't be? Am I bitter? Nah, there's no reason to be bitter. I kind of knew for a while in the back of my head that this is uh, this is the last stop on Amazon anyways and as much as I want to start crying and trust me I do it's it's right it, it's right there it's just it's not, it's not going away. I have to uh, keep in mind that for every choice that I've made, there were five better ones and five worse ones. And I chose the choice that was best suited for that situation. Thank you, Tony, Amara, Suki. Aaron, Nikki, Jessica, Anthony, Tony, Vidali, Eric, Laura, Stevie, St 
Steven. Steve. Charles. Chuck. John. Linda. Other Linda. Other, other Linda. The fourth Linda. Paul. Other Paul. Tom. Tim. Uh, Tam. Tam. Jack. Joshua. Jimmy. James. Shonda. Sharice. Danielle. Christina. Sorry. Well, I know there's a long list. Thank you. Who else? There's like a ton of people. Danny, Malik, Clarissa, thank you Sandy, Hannah, thank you Joe, Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Andrew, David. Aaron. Susie. Thank you, Gary. Thank you. One and all. I truly did enjoy my journey with Amazon. And thank you to the hundreds of people I've interacted with, even if it was just for a little while. Thank you for allowing me to Share a little bit of myself with you. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Here it comes. Oh, man, I said I wouldn't do any more. I'm doing it. I'm doing, I'm, do, I'm doing it. Thank you, uh, Kyle, Katie, and Kristen, and Coco. Thank you to all the fellow water spiders and all the fellow jam clears and Thank you. At the moment, I'm kind of heartbroken. A little bit angry at myself. Thank you, Matt. Thank you. Hey, God. 5S, thank you, Sabrina, thank you, everyone, both on, uh, wait, 
Uh, thank you, Billy. Thank you. To all the AMs, all the PAs, to learning, to problem solve, to everyone I've ever helped. To most importantly of all, Jeff Bezos. But thank you for creating a company that allows people to connect with all walks of life. Thank you for everything. <sighs> Sorry, I'm just snotting up really bad right now. I actually had to do a lot of thinking about how I was going to do this and what I was going to say and how I was going to say it. I was going to write out this this amazing script. It was going to be awesomely worded and talk about all the steps on my journey. It was going to go into you know, the the usual steps that I usually go through when I talk about my time at Amazon. But I want you to take one thing away from this. And one thing alone. Don't ever give up. Don't ever surrender. Don't lose hope. Hey, hey, hey. No tears. Okay. That's my job. No crying. Keep smiling. <sighs> so, stand up straight. Because we're going to do a stand up. <laughs> and I'm going to lead it. <laughs> this one last time. And then we're going to clap it out. Okay, so, safety tip. Get, get away from yourself. The reason being that uh, there's always a chance that your grip could slip on the box cutter itself and you can uh, injure yourself. So you don't want to do that. Luckily, I've never been to Amateur once, so. All right, standard work tip. Um, 
well, let's do an easy one, right? So, six-sided check. Always make sure that you do a six-sided check, especially on the uh, docks. So make sure that the FBA or FRX is on the top of the box. That way when it passes under the camera, it'll uh, recognize where it needs to go and it won't get kicked down to uh, man manual check. Okay. Uh, let's see. We did safety tip. Uh, standard work tip. What about... There's always that third one. The stretches? Alright, yeah. Let, let's stretch it out. Seems like that kind of day, right? Okay. So just follow along. Do what I do. Uh, I know this is everyone's personal favorite. Okay. Pass on number. You good? All right. Okay, so what are we gonna clap it out to? Damn it, that's my nose bleeding again. There we are. Stay hydrated. That that that's a that's a good one, right? Because if you uh, don't stay hydrated, you know you could wind up fatigued, and it's been unusually hot in the UFC these last couple of months. So, yeah. All right, where we where are we gonna clap it out to? Okay, how about? I don't want to say it. How about... Happy Trails. Right? Or... To Be Continued. Or... LGB. Yep. All right. So we're going to start off with with a slow clap, and then we're going to shout as loud as we can. Tears. Maybe just one or two, right? All right, here we are. So follow pace with me. One, two, three. Three, two, one. LGB eight. All right. Well, I gotta go now. So, uh, keep up the good work, every one of you. Never surrender. Don't give up 